Hello everyone, uh, Akbar Tavisiast here. Today I'm going to talk about how to reduce your aquarium temperature by nearly uh, 12 degrees in uh, Fahrenheit. Uh, I live in uh, India where the temperature uh, in summer goes up to nearly 102 degrees in uh, Fahrenheit. Uh, in the morning and in, during the night time it goes to nearly uh, 82 degrees in uh, Fahrenheit. And as you know, uh, I keep African cichlids and then they can tolerate it until uh, 80 degrees in Fahrenheit. So what happened was the last week uh, the, the temperature in my aquarium was 94 in Fahrenheit and uh, four of my fish died. So I was researching the internet and came up with a few steps uh, which I have here implemented and uh, reduced the temperature by 12 degrees. So what happens if the temperature goes really high? First is your fish die and the second one is the oxygen content in your uh, aquarium, it depletes very fast. So the, the, you need to follow uh, two simple steps uh, to reduce the temperature. First, the evaporation in your aquarium need to be really high and the second is you need to pump in a lot of oxygen. So how do we do this? Um, there are six steps that you need to follow. The first one is this canopy. If you have an uh, aquarium that comes with a closed canopy, please uh, remove it. You need to have uh, lots of evaporation. So if you have a closed canopy, it doesn't allow evaporation to happen uh, that fast. So first is removing the canopy. I have my canopy uh, removed. And the second is the lighting. Usually I have my light about uh, eight hours, running uh, eight hours a day, but right now I uh, reduced it to nearly uh, two to three hours a day. So first is removing the canopy, second is the lighting. Keep the lighting to nearly two to three hours a day. And then the third thing is like, um, I don't have a heater in my aquarium from the beginning, so in case if you have a heater installed, please uh, switch it off. That's the third thing. And then the fourth is, you need to pump in a lot of oxygen into the water. So the fourth point is having an uh, air stone. So I have a two feet uh, air stone uh, installed here, which has uh, two inlets, which is powered by a 2.4 watts uh, air, air pump. And then the fifth point is I have a circulation pump, uh, which uh, ha I have it uh, pointing upwards so that uh, it increases the surface agitation and uh, in turn, in turn uh, oxygen gets dissolved in your uh, aquarium and uh, also it helps in uh, evaporation, water evaporation. And then the last uh, sixth point is having a cooling fan or chillers. Chillers are really expensive. So I have, uh, I got uh, two uh, air coolers, which uh, I ran uh, 24 by 7 and it helps in uh, cooling down my uh, aquarium. So right now I'll show you uh, how, how what is the temperature in my uh, aquarium? Oh, it's not focusing. So it's actually uh, 82 in uh, Fahrenheit. Uh, yeah, 84 uh, Fahrenheit uh, as of now. So uh, these are the steps I uh, followed and. Uh, the temperature in my aquarium it dropped to nearly uh, from 94 degree Fahrenheit it dropped to 82 uh, Fahrenheit. Uh, so uh, if you have any uh, suggestions uh, other than this please uh, let me know. It will uh, really uh, help me in uh,